Hi everyone, welcome to My Good Brains February Sunday Art Club. If this is your first time joining us this year, you might notice something a little different. We have changed our format a bit, creating space for you to tap into Sunday Art Club and get creative whenever it works best for you. All year long, you can find all of our Sunday Art Clubs right here on our YouTube channel. So let's get creative and jump into this month's activity. Today, we're going to create a splatter paint self-love mosaic. But first, let's explore the importance of self-love. Self-love is a way to show kindness and appreciation to ourselves. It includes the words we use to describe ourselves, how we celebrate both successes and opportunities to try again, and the ways in which we take care of our needs in order to feel our best. It's an appreciation for everything that makes us who we are, and it helps us to build resilience, strengthen self-esteem, and make healthy choices. We can practice self-love by showing love to our minds, our bodies, and our feelings. The best part about it, it looks different for everyone, and there is no right or wrong way to practice. We're going to practice self-love by creating a splatter paint mosaic and then reflect on affirmations or positive statements that we can use to help us remember just how special we are. Let's get started by gathering our materials and setting up our space. To create your painting, you need a blank piece of paper, a marker or another writing utensil, paint, any kind you have on hand will work, a few paint brushes, and painter's tape. To set up your space, you can turn on some music that helps you to feel calm or energized, or find a quiet space where you can get comfortable and feel relaxed. You may want to grab a journal or extra piece of paper so you can write down or draw any thoughts, feelings, or reflections that come up along the way. Feel free to pause the video and set up your space. Ready? Let's get started. First, take your painter's tape and begin to tape across your paper. Using long pieces of tape, add your tape and you'll start to see different sections appear. You can use crisscross lines or create a pattern. It's up to you. Next, take a moment to soothe out your tape and make sure that it's snug to your paper. You want these lines to stay put when you begin to paint. Once you feel good about your tape and you've checked to make sure it's secure, it's time to paint. Start to paint your paper right over the tape. You can paint different sections, different colors, or keep it all the same. Once you feel good, take a break, set it aside, and let it dry. All right, so now that our painting is dry, it's time to add the splatters. This part could be a little messy, so it's important to make sure you roll up your sleeves and make sure to take your time. Dip your paintbrush into some paint. Next, we're going to splatter. I'll show you a few different ways that you can do this. Once you dip your paintbrush into some paint, using a second paintbrush, tap the handle against the one with the paint and watch colorful drops splatter in all different sizes. You can also use your finger, but this is where it gets a little messy. Dip your paint into some paints and hold your paintbrush with the bristles towards your thumb. Pull your thumb towards you and paint will splatter down onto your paper. If neither of these seem to be working, it may be the paint that you're using. If using a thicker paint, Dilute it with a little bit of water and it should be a little easier. 
Once you feel good, take a break and let this dry. Now it's time to remove the paint and reveal our mosaic. Carefully begin to peel your tape away. Be sure to pull beginning with the piece of tape that is on the top so not to get stuck or tangled under another piece. Pull slowly while holding down on your paper to prevent a tear. If it does tear, no worries, it just adds a little bit of flair to your creation. Once your tape is removed, you should be left with your mosaic. Now, take a moment to brainstorm some positive affirmations that celebrate everything that is you and spreads a little self-love. Some examples might be, I am important, I can do hard things, I am kind. Or you could do things like, I love the way I draw, or I love the way I help my friends. Take your marker and write them in the blank lines that create your mosaic. Repeat until you feel good about your piece. Hang your masterpiece somewhere you can reflect on it often. You don't need to create a splatter paint mosaic to practice self-love. Journal or doodle while reflecting on affirmations, or simply pick an affirmation and repeat it as you're getting ready on your way to school or when you need a little pick-me-up. Self-love can be practiced every day, anywhere, and anytime. Thanks for joining us. Find more Sunday Art Club activities here on My Good Brain's YouTube channel or visit our website at mygoodbrain.org for more information and resources. You can also sign up for our emails to be the first to know when a new lesson debuts. See you next time.